Hello friends, uh, my name is Parwes and uh, today is our first video in Q Qt, uh, C++ and OpenGL. Uh, we are using uh, Qt5 uh, for, for, this, for these videos and uh, in the series of uh, video, video uh, uh, we will learn how to use Open Graphic Library OpenGL. Uh, as you know, OpenGL is a powerful rendering application program interface uh, and combine it with Qta. Uh, OpenGL is a cross-language, uh, cross-platform API for drawing 2D and 3D graphics on, a sc on a screen uh, through the uh, graphic processing unit GPU uh, within our computer's graphic chip. Uh, in, the, in the video series, in these video series, uh, we will be learning a fixed function pipeline. Uh, we are not uh, learning programmable pipeline in the first videos uh, because uh, uh, the f uh, because the fixed function pipeline is easier uh, for beginners uh, to gr to grasp uh, compared to the newer programmable pipeline. Uh, but don't worry, QT support both both versions. Uh, uh, it um, supports a fixed function pipeline, also it supports a programmable pipeline. Uh, uh, in uh, OpenGL, in version of OpenGL version 2, uh, it was a fixed function pipeline, but after that, in uh, later versions uh, like version 3 and 4, uh, it became programmable pipeline. Uh, uh, for the uh, for the purpose of these videos, uh, we will use a uh, fixed function pipeline, but uh, after that, so when you uh, become familiar with OpenGL, uh, we will use a uh, programmable pipeline. Okay. Uh, now, first of all, I'm using Qt5. Uh, open your Qt5 and uh, I make a new project, uh, Qt widget application. Uh, choose, name it, I give it uh, OpenGL Tutorials. Uh, next, uh, next, and the generate form. Uh, no, we don't want a generate form. Uh, just uncheck it. Next and finish. Okay. Uh, now, in here we have uh, our main window dot h, uh, main window dot c dot cpp, and also main dot cpp. Okay. First of all, for uh, for perform performing OpenGL in Qta. Uh, you should open your uh, uh, .pro uh, file and in here uh, just uh, add OpenGL uh, also add libs uh, OpenGL32 and uh, uh, glue32 ok now close this and save all uh, now it will process uh, the dot profile. It will update the dot profile. Okay. And now we can uh, in our main window dot h. Okay. Uh, first of all, you should include uh, uh, q um, open OpenGL window. Okay. Uh, and um, because uh, uh, we are using q OpenGL window class. Uh, uh, instead of Q main window uh, for the main for uh, our main window, uh, because it is designed to easily create and create windows uh, that for performs uh, OpenGL rendering, and uh, it also offers a better performance uh, compared uh, to OpenGL widget. Okay, now we should inherit from our Q open window like this. Uh, now and uh, in here, you should make a protected access uh, modifier. Uh, first one, uh, uh, Q, uh, I will tell you that uh, Q OpenGL window has uh, uh, a class that uh, provides uh, several vir uh, virtual functions uh, like initialize GL, resize GL, pen GL, and uh, some other methods uh, that. Um, uh, we can use uh, uh, 
simply and easily and also we can set up our OpenGL and perform our graphics rendering okay and uh, now uh, we want some uh, first one is uh, virtual uh, white uh, initialize GL okay uh, the second one is uh, virtual white uh, uh, resize GL okay mm. another one we have uh, virtual void uh, paint uh, paint GL <coughs> okay uh, we are not using these methods in this video uh, but uh, in the later videos uh, we will use uh, uh, from these methods okay uh, another one is uh, Avoid in here and resize GL. You should give an int width and int height. Okay, and uh, another one is uh, void uh, resize event. Uh, Resize uh, Q resize event Q resize event and uh, event. Uh, also, we have uh, uh, void uh, paint event mm, Q Q paint Q paint event. Okay, uh, now we should. Uh, this was our declaration, our functions. Now we want to declare these functions in our uh, main window.cpp. Okay, in QJ, you can simply write in here, uh, right click and refactor, uh, add definition in main window.cpp. Okay, uh, open again uh, the second one. Refactor and uh, definition to win main window dot h. Uh, open this uh, another one. Add definition. Uh, another one. Refactor and definition. And also we have uh, the last one. Refactor and definition. Okay. Now we have uh, these uh, methods in our uh, uh, main window.cpp. Okay. Now in in main window.cpp, first of all, remove this. Mm. And here mm, uh, you can write uh, set set surface type set surface type uh, q window open open gel surface okay uh, we must call this uh, because uh, uh, we want we should uh, tell uh, Qta uh, that we are using open gel to render the image to screen uh, we are not using cube printer and instead of cube printer we want to use uh, open gel for rendering of our uh, uh, rendering of our image in, in the screen. Okay, uh, now uh, open your main.cpp file <coughs> in here. First of all, set title. Uh, I give it uh, the title, I give uh, mm, OpenGL tutorial okay also uh, resize I give it 640 and 450 okay uh, now I want to run this first of all I built
okay I don't have any problem uh, just now I can run this now you can see that this is our first uh, OpenGL window in PyQt in Qt5 uh, OpenGL tutorial this is our um, it was our title okay uh, let me run again yeah uh, okay thank you guys uh, if you have any question uh, please uh, let me know uh, and for the further videos uh, please subscribe my channel